Hello, friends, and welcome to another video lesson from DBO Stocks. If you haven't subscribed yet, please click subscribe and click the bell so that you can be notified of new uploads. This video is part of the Excel tutorial series, and we here we'll be learning how to search for a cell value that contains a special character, okay, in Excel. First, let's try finding a regular character, okay? Let's try finding something not special, okay? So we do a control F, which is to find something, and then I will um, try to search a bunch of text, which is already existing in this sheet. Um, the one in cell C4. So I will do a find, and it finds that. In fact, if I do a find all, it only finds one occurrence of that text. Okay, so that is straightforward. So regular searching, searching regular text that which doesn't contain or include a special character. Now let's try searching text which contains special character in it. Okay. Let's try using an asterisk. I mean, trying to find an asterisk. Notice that the cell C6 has an asterisk. If you look at this one, C6, um, the text in it contains some asterisks and even one would be good enough to, as an example, to demonstrate this difficulty that you may encounter okay, in Excel. So let's just say we're trying to find that in a cell, which in a sheet, which has so many cells. Okay, so let's try typing this. So let's just say I'm trying to look for this, for the cell or for the location of the cell which has this text. Okay, so I will do a find here. And if you will notice what it's doing is, it's going to, you might say all the wrong places, but it actually is making sense. Um, in Excel, the asterisk works such as the same as how it does in Microsoft DOS Windows. It works as a wildcard character for multiple characters, one or more characters. So it is actually when we do a find, it is looking for any cell which contains the letter T and followed by something else. Okay. So all of those fields that have been found actually contain the letter T in it. So if I do a find all, it finds seven of them. All of these contain the letter T. That's the meaning of the, that's the reason why these are cells are being found. So it's not actually a mistake. It's just that the wildcard character is at work, the asterisk. Okay, so get, to get around it, maybe in your use case, you're actually looking for an actual text which contains the asterisk, not necessarily meaning uh, referring to a wildcard character as a wildcard character, okay? So what you will do is you will use some kind of an escape character, if you will, in Excel, and that is the tilde, T-I-L-D-E. So what you will do is you will type the tilde right in front or right before the special character you're looking for. Okay, in this case is the asterisk, which is giving me problems, okay? So I can do a find, I can put my focus somewhere else just to be sure it's not, it's not, um, I mean, not making it any easier, okay? So again, the sort of escape character to find text which contains a special character is to use a tilde right in front or right before the special character, in this case, the asterisk. So I will do a find next now. And it finds that, okay? It's a C6, cell C6. It has the text T, asterisk, asterisk, asterisk. Okay, it was found because of the help of the tilde, which I put in front or before the special character. In fact, if I do a find all, it should only find one instead of the seven that uh, was previously shown here, okay? So sure enough, when I do a find all, it only finds one instance of that text, one which contains T, asterisk, asterisk, asterisk. This time, the asterisk 
um, is not working, is not being interpreted as being a wildcard character, but rather the actual characters themselves. Okay. Next is we'll try another special character. Uh, and this time it is the question mark. Okay. Question mark, it may not be obvious, but um, even in SQL, I believe, and uh, some of the languages, it is treated as a wildcard character for a single character. Okay, maybe not as good. Maybe for something like it could be DOS or I forgot. But it it really works. It is being used in other languages as a wildcard character, matching a single character only as against the asterisk. Okay, so if you will look for asterisk i mean question mark if you'll put it you'll do a control f and then you will type in there uh, question mark and then try to find what will happen is it will actually match anything that contains a character because it's a wild card character after all so that's not what you need right so in this case you could actually be looking for the question mark Character. So in this case, this is not what I need. This is not helping me. So again, you will use the same technique that we have used in the first example, which is to use the tilde as an escape character right before the special character. In this case, the special character I'm against or I'm facing is the question mark, which is working as a single character while character. Okay, so I will do that by entering this tilde right before the question mark. And then when I do that, and then I do a find next, it will find it correctly found the cell C11, which contains the question mark or a question mark. OK, so again, if I do a find all in this case, there's only one instance of that uh, such cell with the question mark in it. So if I do a find all, I should only find one. OK, and it only found one. OK, so in this video, we learned how we learn how to find, do a search of text which contains special characters in Excel. And that is something you will not encounter on a daily basis, but once it comes, it's good to know, okay? So thank you for watching and thank you for listening. If you haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe, hit the bell and spread the word. I'll be seeing you in the next video.